we can say that 80% of the city of Raqqa has been liberated, the statement said. The Syrian Observatory for Human Rights said on Wednesday that the SDF had taken more than 90% of the city, adding that the major remaining hurdle for the forces was a large concentration of mines in the area. The remaining is militants in the city have nearly run out of food and munitions, the observatory reported. Islamic State is also battling two separate offensives in eastern Syria, launched by the SDF on one side and the Syrian army and its allies on the other in Deir al-Zor province. The Syrian army, backed by Russian and Syrian warplanes, has made wide advances along the Euphrates' western riverbank, the observatory reported. Syrian troops also crossed to the eastern side of the river on Monday. The SDF's advances have been on the eastern bank of the river. The convergence of the two rival offensives has increased tensions in Deir al-Zor. The militia on Monday warned against any further Syrian army advances on the eastern riverbank. A fire at a major gas field known as Conoco raged through Tuesday night and into Wednesday, the observatory said, after Syrian state media reported that the army was advancing toward it. Islamic State had fled the area, the observatory said. The hardline militants lost their main stronghold in Iraq, the city of Mosul, in July to western-backed Iraqi forces.